Hi guys, it's Vanessa. First of all, I just wanted to come on and say Happy Easter. It's Easter Sunday today, um, and I just wanted to do a really quick um, Splurge versus Steel Presents that I alluded to in my last video. And that is all about these new things that came out with Art Supply, and they are the MAC um, Pro Longwear Lip Stain Markers. So, just a little quick info on these. If you don't know what they are, they're exactly what they look and sound like. It is a marker as you can see, that you just directly apply onto your lips. Um, it makes, it creates sort of a stain. It's not gonna be a shiny finish at all. It's like a matte finish. Um, and it's just going to stain your lips like any other lip stain would if you have the Pinch Me Cheek and Lip Stain from, um, I forgot, I think that was like the Rose Romance collection, if you have that. If you have um, the lip stains from um, previous collections before that they came out, the little like glosses that stain your lips, it's like that. If you have the Benetint from Benefit, just like that. It's literally what I said, it's a lip stain. Um, so you're not gonna get any shine with them, they're just like a matte finish. It's kind of like, gives the effect of like drinking Kool-Aid when you're a kid and your lips get stained. So. This product is currently out with the MAC Art Supplies um, website, and sorry, I'm reading it because uh, I have it pulled up here. Um, there are, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine shades, and you get um, 0 0.09 fluid ounces, um, which I think is 2.5 grams of product, 2.5 grams of product for $16. Um, I really think that these are great products. I love them personally. I'm not wearing them today, but it kind of gives this effect. But um, I just like them because they're very long wear. Um, like I said in my last video, I had picked up two. I picked up the Style Setter and the Purposefully Red because they are both very bright, a bright pink and a bright red. And these two things are, you know, very common statement lips that people like to wear. I love a statement lip. And this just makes a statement lip so easy because you can put it on underneath your favorite red or pink lipstick as just kind of insurance so that when your lipstick fades, you still have a full lip of color on and you don't look worn or crazy. Also really good if you want to wear them on their own as a statement lip and you can leave them matte for a really nice, cool, I just think it's a cool like um, spring kind of indie look. It looks a lot like Mary Kate and Ashley's lips, like that look that they always have to their lips. It's really cool. It just looks like you just had some Kool-Aid or some wine and it's very carefree and cool. Or you could add some gloss to make it look more like a lipstick and you could really play with the finish of it um, just by topping it with a gloss or other lipstick. However, these run $16 each. Um, so that can get a little bit pricey for someone who wants to you know, have this type of product, a lip stain marker, which is a really cool product to have in their collection, but maybe they're on a budget. What I have to show you today is these. Now these are lip markers and I will, sorry, I'm in front of a window, so I'm like, who is that? <laughs> but it's the exact freaking same thing. It's a lip marker and these are from Mark and they're called the Kiss Inks um, and they are really cool. They currently, I have three colors because I got these when they had a larger range. I was just going to say the downfall of the cheaper alternative from Mark is that they only come currently in two colors and I have them both. Um, they come in, oh, I don't have them. I thought I did. It comes in Berry Bitten, which I don't own. Or I thought I owned that. But anyways, Berry Bitten and this one, Red Siren. Now. There, I don't have any for the colors that I have exact dupes. I did swatches. These are the Mark ones right here. So we have um, here. This one is the pink tees. This one is the oh, I'm pink kiss. This one is pink kiss in the middle. And was I right? I'm all a mess. Sorry, it was. So this one is pink tees, which is this marker right here. This one is Pink Kiss, which is this marker, which is actually more of like a lavender color. I'm sorry, I'm in front of the window, so that's much more accurate. So we have Pink Kiss, Pink Tees, and then this one is the Red Siren, which is actually more of a maroon. On the bottom, I have my two MAC ones. This one is Purposefully Red, and this one is Style Setter. So as you can see, there aren't in my collection exact dupes, however, um, you know, like I said, if it's more the idea of it and it's not necessarily like um, the exact color that you like, 
here's a red one, here's a pink one. And these are $7 each. So you could buy both of them for less than the price of one of these. And these come with the exact same amount of product in them. They both have the 2.5 grams um, of product inside. So I just think that's really cool. Um, what was I going to say about these? Oh, my swatches, don't let my swatches deter you because I've had these for years. So mine are, um, they're getting a little drawn out. Like there's not, it's not as much color. Um, and I'll just show you what I mean. Like that line, I don't know if you could see it kind of went on a little bit faint, but if I do it with the MAC one, it's like marker. So, I mean, and I will, um, to the defense of the MAC one, when I did first purchase these, I remember them being a little bit drier than this even was, but even so, they all eventually do fade out. And there is also, if you don't have a MAC representative or you don't want to get shipped online, I know that the drugstore, I mentioned this before, CoverGirl carries them. I will put a link in the sidebar for those as well. I don't know how much those are. Um, let me just quickly look them up on drugstore.com. But um, I'm sure they're not going to be that much, and they're really just, like I said, a really fun different product to have. Um, you can have so many lipsticks, lip glosses, and you get kind of bored with it, so it's fun to have like a different fun product. When you take them out of your um, purse, people are like, are you putting Sharpie on your lip? What are you doing? So it's like a fun conversation um, starter. I just personally think that they're a great product. So I'm going to try to look it up really quick. I'm sorry I wanted this video to be a little bit shorter. Um, cover girl. I think they're called lip stains outlast something outlast the cover girl outlast lip stains and they're on drugstore.com which is pretty accurate to what drugstore prices are they say that they are $7.49 but they're currently buy one get one free on drugstore.com so there you go you have that option as well I'm going to put all the links in the sidebar, like I said, for the MAC one, for the MARC one, and for the CoverGirl one because I think you guys can get your art supplies at any price. So once again, happy Easter, and I will talk to you guys later. Bye.